Okay, Woody's a oh, nice easy one to start with. Welcome to game one of Positively Fantastic, where I'm going to try to stay positive whilst playing fantastic. <laughs> it's Spartaco! <laughs> so, I'm playing the best coach for the best race. Brilliant! Doesn't get much easier than this. Um, but I will try to play my best. That's all I can do, isn't it? And if, if the dice go bad or he outplays me, then so be it. But there you go. Matchups like this make me want to not <laughs> use <laughs> chaos, <laughs> to be honest, because, you know, like, obviously it's rare. I mean, it's literally the best coach in Champs Ladder. No offence, Ducky. Um, you know, it's not like I'd be saying the same if it was Ducky or Muldrifter as well. You know, it's all one of the best, isn't it? Um, but they're all around the same level, aren't they, at the end of the day? Um, I'm going to kick, so he's going to have to try and stall it out. I think that's, that's the thing there. On the Anarian star, hasn't he? Just lets him go through the middle for a quick score, which doesn't really bother me. Hmm. That stops the. That no, doesn't really stop the middle, does it? Okay, let's go like this. It really seems really lame though. I don't want to put everyone on the tree though. That's the thing, isn't it? Let's go with this. Let's do this. Right. Hello, Devil's Eye. Hello, Valene. <laughs> Not casual, not very casual. No, I'm just going to try to uh, be positive and focus. That's basically, if I do that, I'm alright, aren't I? That's it. Yeah, Jelly will an easy first match, yeah. Oh, dear. I didn't know there was a 5 and 0. I just saw the top two chaos were 9, 3, 6 and 8, 6, 9. And I thought, you know what, I'll give, them a, I'll give them a go. Try to get something out early, you know. Because um, the thing is, Wood Elves can always try late in the season, can't they? If Wood Elves get a wizard, Wood Elves getting a wizard every game can do quite all right. Um, Chaos getting a wizard every game, not so much. So, so that's the idea behind starting like this. Dingo. Dirty Dino, he's gone for his passes. Ungo that far, Keander. 
If I had maybe some Wood Elf team as well, it would be. But now this is just a Titan crushing an idiot. Try to get lucky with a hit on the dancer. Hope to hope the guys without dodge. Fuck me. Should have moved them over first, that's why I did that. Good old half mans. You can't you can't expect him to give any respect to rookie chaos. I know I wouldn't. If I if I had if I was running Wood Elves and I got drawn against Spartacus Chaos in the first round, I'd be like, get in. I get to beat him probably three 0 and uh, skill up my guys. <laughs> no, <laughs> there's no need for respect against rookie chaos, is there? Three pieces of the tree. No, I didn't. Really bad run so far, Jester, but tell me there's a chance. Don't even uh, surf the warrior, do I? Guess it's harder from the surf if they're all going. They're all going in. Oh, GHC Damocles. No, for China died last night, Kales. He will not, not last night, yesterday. I just the first game I was down. I was up 150 TV. Give a wizard to Skaven. He scored quickly. <laughs> he scored quickly, then he got the ball on my drive and went 2 0 up. 
and he had a wizard in hand, so there was no way I was going to possibly uh, do anything, so I conceded. And I haven't deleted the team yet, but, you know. Alright, he's more likely to bash me, probably, in this game, seeing as he's got two block and a strength 690 blow. He's probably more likely to out bash me. Four, four dodges here, though. He ain't blocking with any of these, so... He could absolutely fail at one of these dodges. Uh, he's getting a 2D on the beast there, isn't he? No, it didn't follow. Surprising. I thought it would have followed there. Oh, he got a push. If he'd followed there, and then, oh, then he would have left the what, dancer in contact, wouldn't he? Which I guess he didn't want. No, I haven't. Uh, the YouTube's quite a way behind. Quite a way behind is YouTube. I mean, you know, it's got to be. Right. Let's get him in there. Give away a block to a tree. No, don't don't want to. Let's see if this guy goes on the sideline. Yes, he does. I know that didn't maximise box. So fucking sue me. Um, huge hole here, isn't there? But. That's why he's there to try and shore up a bit. Guess this guy didn't need to go so far forward. Maybe he should have been one back or something. Maybe he's in two back. Not easy to turn from, is it, really? Makes his dodge with dodge. Dingo. Yeah, probably gonna... I think even if he goes in the middle here, then at least I'll, I, it makes these three relevant again. So it's not so bad. But obviously, yeah, cage around the tree. And while I can base some guys without dodge, Loads of his guys have got dodge, so basing them's basically irrelevant. Yeah, he's gonna cage in here, isn't he? Just hand off. in one turn, disgusting. Yeah, 
Yeah, I didn't really, I really didn't like standing this guy up. GFI. And put guys around here. Do the hit things as far as he can get anyway. Strength three. No, maybe he should have gone in there. I'll let that fuck let that way out, haven't I? Don't know. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then one, two, three, four, five, GFI. Stops the tree blitz, so it's not irrelevant, is it? I need him there, otherwise, he can just leap over here or just dodge through here. So, while it's still an easy touchdown for him, I might fail the roll, might he? Stranger things have happened. Yeah, three ones. Only one mattered. Like the other, like that's the thing, you know. Like him rolling three ones on dodges, two of them didn't matter, did they? Because they were one in thirty-six chances. So the fact that he rolled them on the first one, the only thing that mattered was getting my hopes up that he would actually fail. But on the stats, he looks really unlucky. Whereas, you know, it's not necessarily. Unlucky to roll a one on the first one into one in thirty six fillers. Ah, so you had that way. But it's nah, it's not that hard, it's just dodge the dodge, isn't it? Ugh. I I didn't like letting him out that back way. I, although like this gets me more guys behind, which I didn't really like. I wanted to jam up in front. I wanted to blitz this guy and jam more in front of him. And having guys behind, but I thought it was too easy to just dodge out around that way. And I don't know why I thought that was so scary. But I just did. I don't know, maybe I over, overthought myself. Needs another one, doesn't he? Yeah, he's got the dancer and everything. Yeah, I guess I should have should have gone with my original idea. Which is to blitz up this way. Warrior blitz in there and then another guy. Can just roll twos, can't he? <laughs> Can this guy reach? No, he's not that bad. Could have been. Oh. 
This would be a four, four, three. <laughs> I don't think that's worth it. I have to blitz him and base the ball even though it doesn't fucking achieve anything. This one, yeah. That's the the first the first two plus <laughs> that was like a, a bad fail for me, and I rolled a one on it. Pretty good. Double GFI to base him. And a GFI to get in there. I didn't really care about them failing. TBH fans. Him blitzing is not going to be very relevant. Him dodging isn't going to be so relevant, actually, is it? What if I make a double GFI? Then it can be. Yeah, alright, this is low odds. But if it works, it's nice. <laughs> yeah, done. It's pretty much the worst puzzle matchup, yeah. Yeah. Hello, Wolfpack. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It is a bit. A bit of a poor matchup. Not KO'd, yeah, unbelievable, wasn't it? A bit of a bad matchup, Spartaco with Wood Elves, the former number one player in the world with Wood Elves. With Wood Elves. <laughs> Against Chaos. <laughs> so. Yeah, probably have, I probably have. I mean, you can't, I mean, I can't protect against everything, can I, at the end of the day? I thought slamming in like this was good. Makes him roll some dice. It's I feel happy with how I've done this turn. I don't see an obvious easy play for him to get out of this. I do believe in myself. I mean, I think I don't think he's better than me. <laughs> you know, I really don't think Spartaco is better than me. I know he's been ranked number one Wood Elf player in the world in rankings and stuff, but so fucking what? You know, I've barely played tabletop. Um, so you know, and the fact that he's been number one. I mean, I'm sure Pete W and Purple Goo and Enzone. Well, Enzone hasn't been because he's barely played tabletop. But all those would be number one at some point. I've been number one on Fumble at some point. So you know. It doesn't. It's all swings and roundabouts at the end of the day. Good players are good players, aren't they? Uh, this is his drive. One dice block without a reroll. All one dice are skulls. Get in. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, my God. Fash is satisfied with the outcome of that play. Exactly, Wolfpack. Exactly. You know, it, but it's right though, isn't it? You know, it's just it. It doesn't. None of it means a lot. To be honest. Oh god. Oh, it's pretty good, wasn't it? Three dice on the ball. I could surf him, of course, but let's be serious for a minute and just take the fucking power. Hmm. 
Yeah, they're all good. Everyone in the top 50 in the world are good. You know, or top 50 rated in the top 50. They're all good. Um, but it just doesn't mean a lot. It doesn't, just doesn't mean a lot, does it? That's, the, that's all. That's all I'm saying. And it's, it's true. Got GFI. I've got to get it on a... Well, I don't have to get it on a warrior. I'd like to get it on a warrior. You could go in there and I could three dice here. I could two dice there. You could blitz come down. I know this means a GFI after I do it. I'm aware of that. <laughs> But, um, Should've pushed him to there, fuck. Should've pushed him to there, then I can't push him out. Right, I'm going to pick up next anyway. Yep. My nine pick up, get in. Yeah, like they're all good, aren't they? Yeah, Kafold is better than most, how you pronounce it. Yeah. Like they're all good at the end of the day. Um, they're all fucking, you know, everyone in the top 50 or 100 even on Fumble. Okay, some on Fumble aren't because they can min max. But then, and I guess there's probably some in, ta in tabletop that aren't that good because you can gain your ranking in tabletop. But, um, I mean, just four plus pick up. <laughs> <laughs> Got a catcher there. Just fucking four plus dodge in, four plus pick up, dodge out, pass it, score. Hmm. No, he's not going to do that. That's a tree man! It's a tree man blitz! 50 50 to even get the hit. Good. <laughs> Absolute madman. Um, no, I'm not. I'm, I was a bit unfortunate one in nine in the pickup there. I wasn't happy about that. Knowing that it's about to go. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Hand off, run away. Is looking doable. I can power that guy and get in the way here. Could surf him, but I really like the idea of, of fucking scoring, don't I? Maybe I'm getting a little greedy here. <laughs> and when I say a little, I mean a lot. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. Can one deem me with him. I could push him out of range. So he's the only threat. He's based. 
Oh, you can't! <laughs> oh no! 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 And I only needed one to get in scoring range, but the second one made it harder for him to get me because he's got no rerolls. Man, how unlucky can you get? How unlucky? Do you know what I mean? Oh, oh man, that's just that's just evil. That's just. I think that was worth it, you know. Against, against, fucking Spartaco, I think that was worth it. He's got no rerolls, <laughs> and he gets a double score. He's got no rerolls. That was that was. Oh, he could have chained him forward as well. He could have chained him forward. Anyway, but still, oh, fucking hell. Yes, exactly. Because I had the reroll and he didn't. Yeah, I think it was absolutely a good idea. I think it was absolutely a good play. I, I don't regret the play at all. Um, just fucking unlucky, wasn't it? Sim just unlucky. Simple as that. Oh man. <laughs> Brutal to get cast for it. I had a touchdown. I had a touchdown and then I got fucking cast instead. <laughs> fucking hell. <sighs> Stop fucking fighting everything. Ah! That's about as unlucky as it fucking gets. Way worse than his skull on a one dice block to try and do something. Might be out bashed by Woody's here. Oh man, if his dancer stays out, that's good though. <sighs> okay, good. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I couldn't risk having eight men. No, no, I couldn't. I couldn't fall. I couldn't fall. I couldn't risk going down to eight men. Right, at least his dancer stayed out. Fucking hell. Oh, God. oh man, that was a touchdown into a cast. Can you believe that? Fuck me. Thanks, Inver Augustus. Yeah, I'm proud of how I played at least. <laughs> but you know, 1 0 up, uh, it would still be scary. I guess the, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter too much. Oh, no, it would because I could just stall for a, a nil nil half, couldn't I? Um, but yeah, 1 0 up, I could just not even try to score. Whereas now he can, he can make it hard for me to score, so yeah, and then a draw. I guess he's got, he's got to go for a win because he's Wood Elves against Chaos. So he's just got to go for the win. Um, so he can't just stop me scoring and go for a 0 0. He can't. He has to push for the win here. Um, so I guess it doesn't really change much for him. I 
know you don't need to dwell on the past and everything. Blah, 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 blah. And I am staying positive. But wow, that was unlucky, wasn't it? That was really unlucky. That was really, really, really unlucky. And regardless of how many ones we both rolled at the end of the day or whatever, that was really, 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 really unlucky. <laughs> Really unlucky. Don't know if I've made it clear or not, but that was really unlucky. <laughs> ah, dear me. Right, Warrior's gonna carry anyway. And Warrior can punch here. And just hit a safe, uh, make a safe blitz there. He's got to get hammered by a tree. If he gets a blitz, I'm just fucked. There's nothing, nothing I can do against it. I guess this is the most I can do against a blitz. Still not much. Maybe I should put the warrior there. Nah. Just hit him. And then follow and keep him on a strength fall guy. Not his dancer. His guy stunned, my guy's KO'd. Great. Great, just what I need against. against Spartaco. He's just gonna have to blitz and run away, aren't I? by Woody's. Testing the positive side of this fucking deal, isn't it? Hello, Necrobotans. Hello, I can't style. <laughs> This is the first game here, backyard dodo. And I should be I should be one nil up and not have a guy cast. And not have that guy KO'd by the rock either. So Yeah. He didn't, he didn't put pressure on. I'm actually shocked. I'm literally shocked that he didn't put pressure on there. I guess he doesn't have to, but still.
Got to get forward, haven't I? That's the fucking problem. I was unlucky because it was the only way I could go, wasn't it? One, two, three, four. No, I could have gone one, two, three, four, five. That's how I should have done it. I should have gone one, two, three, four, five. Now, if, when he blocks and follows, he's got both tied up. I guess it, if I'd gone here, he would have been in his tackle zone anyway, but still, both in the trees. It's pretty bad play. Bad play. Gotta play better. Focus. Use the time. that stun so that's why he, it is stun rock he didn't really want to get in the way that turn I guess three dice mighty blow blocks every turn are a, a problem aren't they not a lot I can do about it This is just a nightmare now because I can't. I can't do anything. <laughs> Dodge him to make the cage corner. And then I could base him and then blitz him. Yeah, okay. Rather bliss with him, but wanted a tight cage against the leap. Yep, there you go, Valene. <laughs> Summing it up perfectly. Uh, nothing permanent, no. No, 0-0 zero, zero isn't a bad result, but it's really frustrating when it should be 1-0, shouldn't it, you know? That's the thing. And then it wasn't 1-0, it was a guy cast as well, only badly hurt. But still. Yeah, I guess the tree in. And then I would have followed as well. If I'd done that blitz after, I would have could have followed then, and then he'd have only been hitting two instead of three. Maybe he'll hit these two though, instead of these three. Yeah, exactly, Valenic. Yeah. yeah. Why am I still not playing birds? <laughs> um, it's it's. I can't see how I draw here now. It's getting, it's getting too hard to draw now. It's just getting more likely that he's going to turn me over, isn't it? I need him to fail the tree stand up. I just don't even have the men to 
to push forward anyway even if his tree stays down of course it doesn't <sighs> I've just got to try and make it a nil nil, and then he'll he'll push for the win. And then that'll give me an opening. That's what I've got the bank on. <laughs> if I just give up scoring. Yeah, now he's pushing in. Just got to hope for a fail. fail from the start of course somehow either through dice or through play one of the two Unfortunately, he doesn't want to do it, does he? He doesn't want to cooperate by playing shit. Anti-social of him, if you ask me. There was a bit of a weakness there. If he hadn't moved that in, could have blitzed him, gone there, blocked and blocked, and then would have been somewhat safe. But oh, It's looking real bad now. Really, really, really. One day him, uphill him. Maybe I shouldn't have done that actually with him not having any rerolls, eh? But I don't know, it's looking really bad. Maybe he can fucking serve me here or something. Hello, El Mato. Good dodge the warrior. I was gonna, I was gonna uphill the tree, Valenia, because I thought obviously I don't mind about the bolt down, do I? Even though I don't have block, I don't mind if I put him on his ass. Four plus to send him back up, so I thought blocking him was better. And at least now we can't blitz the free tree, blitz the tree free, and stuff. By doing it at the end. Yeah, but it's just literally going for the power. One in four to power. Wasn't wasn't bad I thought. <laughs> there we are. 
dead warrior. <laughs> two kills, two cars, one kill, uh, one cars and two kills. Yeah, it's not crazy, you know. He's got he's got a three, three dice mighty blow monster, hasn't he? And uh, he's got more block than me. Oh, chaining the tree—that's good, isn't it? Is a good idea. Turns. And I mean now there's definitely no chance of winning. I just need to get the tree out of the way, don't I? Which is achieved by running all the way back here. And then here. And then here and here. Battle to a nil-nil and a dead warrior. I'm not keeping the team even if I win. So, I just 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 playing for pride, isn't it? Also, if I draw, I, I make Spartaco remake as well. <laughs> so, so, there is that. Now it's just playing for pride. Now it's Sparta going in our in with Woodies this time. Holy shit. Last time it wasn't worth playing Woodies because there was Sparta going in our in. Now there's. Uh, sorry, Ducky in in our in. Now it's Sparta going in our in. So Wood Elves not looking a good shout this season. I should have gone even further back, shouldn't I? I couldn't really. Yeah, I'm proud of how I played here. I thought I, thought I played better than him. But, uh, yeah, there's not much you can do when your touchdown turns into a cast, is it? And then you get a thrown rock removal as well. So, <laughs> just, you know, ridiculous look, really. I think I'll just carry on chaos for a bit. Keep trying to get the chaos off the ground. And it's got to, it's got to be an easier start than this, hasn't it? Yeah, a draw is a draw is not good enough for Spartaco <laughs> in his first game with Woodies. You know, he's, he, that's not. It's just crap, isn't it? He would expect to beat ninety nine point nine percent of the players in football. To right, do I go stupid now? Do I go stupid? I could do now. I could go stupid. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and go all the way over there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and get to here. That means these guys can reach, but they can get uh, guys on them. He would need to get powered. He can get pushed back there. This guy could go in the way there. I could draw it. I could I could play safe for the draw now. <laughs> but I think I should go crazy for the win now. One, two, three, four, five. And last one there. Yeah, this is where I try for the win and lose, yeah. Because his dancer's still on its feet. I needed to power the dancer. Realistically. It's super easy for me to get a one dice. It's not hard for me to get a two dice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, five. What could they, where could this guy go? Obviously, this, this makes his touchdown more easy, but fuck it, I've got to go for the win. That makes it harder, doesn't it? There you go. He's just got to roll some two pluses, it's not even hard. You can probably even chain and stuff, especially as I freed up that guy. Oh! Oh, freeing up that guy probably was bad. Now he comes straight in here, blocks him, pushes him to there. Now he just goes for the one dice block. Come on, roll a skull. No. No, I, I could have drawn anyway. At least I'm. I can. I can. I can uh, rest easy in the knowledge that uh, I could have drawn. I could have drawn nil nil. Almost certainly, you'd have had to uphill the, uphill the warrior. Which is pretty good, considering how much I was diced. I could have 2 would the catcher, yeah, but I wanted to make it harder for his dancer to hit me. Hitting the catcher only makes the draw more likely, doesn't it? At that point, once I've committed to go for the win, I want to try and get the win, not reduce the chances of a draw, you know. Could have drawn. Yeah, a draw. A draw would have been... And if I was 1-0 up, I would have just huddled in the corner and, and, and got the win, probably. Probably. Maybe not. I mean, his uphill odds aren't, aren't bad, are they? Three, four, five, six, hand off to the warrior so he can't uphill me. I mean, so he can't not uphill me. <laughs> can't base him, but fuck it.
Facing him doesn't matter because he wants to score this one anyway. But fuck it. That <laughs> gives me minus one, but also pays the same. <laughs> <laughs> Two dead teams, brilliant. Right. <laughs> Good. Roll him next game with new teams, oh please no. Uh, let's get pushed. So still a draw then, a draw's not bad is it, but it should have been a win. Should have been a win. I mean it absolutely should have been a win, there's no, there's no... You know, that's not... That's, uh, they've got the moral victory for sure there, the one in 36. The one in 36 there was really horrible. You can, of course, yeah, backyard daughter, yeah. <laughs> Three AV breaks to 12. And yet somehow, somehow I had less men on the pitch. <laughs> um, but there you go. Equal blocks completely. Unbelievable, Jeff. And two dead teams. Brilliant. I'll still put this game on YouTube, though, because I was quite proud of it. Quite proud of it. The, the JFIs don't look that bad, do they? But it was just it was just the crucial one. It was the double one, and the crucial one was really horrible, wasn't it? And his dodges look bad, but again, a lot of those were, were ones on when he had dodge. His take roots were outstanding. His stand-up was good. No, oh, his JFIs were were pretty poor. <laughs> there you go. Right. Well, that's a dead team, isn't it? A dead warrior. Not enough money for an apple and a draw. Um, but it was a good game, so I'll probably put it on YouTube. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.